tonight. No criminal charges for a former Bengal accused of sexual assault. Chinadum and Duke Way cleared today by Hamilton County's prosecutor Joe Dieters. In fact, Dieters is now planning to forward a complaint to the Supreme Court of Ohio and the Supreme Court of Georgia about the attorneys for the accuser. And WLW2 News 5's anchor Stephen Albritton joining us now with where this case goes from here. Stephen? Well, there's a lot here. That complaint focuses on the attorneys representing the woman accusing in Duke Way of assault. The former Bengal has maintained that this was a case of extortion. According to in Duke Way's attorney, the woman wanted $10 million to make all of this go away. The victim told us a month ago and Duke Way sexually assaulted her, but Dieter says the former Bengal did nothing criminal. Instead, he says it's the attorneys for the accusers who need to be investigated. Dieter is writing in part that the victim's attorneys told in Duke Way's attorneys if the victim doesn't cooperate, quote, it makes the job almost impossible for police. The statement goes on to say, quote, the attorneys for the former employee also pressured Mr. In Duke Way to settle, saying, once we get cops involved and once the media gets involved to start this, you know, the numbers are going to jump because now she's got more stress and she's got more pain. Dieter says sending this complaint to the state Supreme Courts in Ohio and Georgia will allow for a review of possible ethical violations for those attorneys. And again, no criminal charges against Nduque. Stephen Albert and WLWT News 5.